Hi, Tara Lovebugs. It's Ethany and it's First Impressions Friday on my channel. Boop, boop. That time of the week. And I have a new deck for you today. It is the Alki Oracle. Um, oh, by my friend, Arwen Lynch. I'm so proud of you, Arwen Lynch Poe. You are just amazing. This is artwork by Melanie Delon and a guidebook by Arwen. It's the Ellie Key or El Key or She Who. That's what the, the L key means. And you're going to see that when we start to go through the deck. I've seen a couple of images, of course, because I'm A, I'm friends with R1 and B. I've seen them around. Love this silver on the front. Love me some shimmers. Love me some shines. It's a 44 deck card deck um, by US Game Systems. And we're now going to go swap over the camera and go through the She Who or the L key Oracle deck. Alrighty, so now let's discover the El Key Oracle together by, the artwork is by Melanie Delon and it is written by Arwen Lynch Poe and look at this gorgeous silver gilded goodness. I am definitely a magpie, I like shiny things. <clears throat> this is published by US Game Systems. It's very pretty. Their boxes are always great. Oh, that, oh, look at that. She's looking at me with some fierceness there. The blue is so gorgeous too. I knew it was going to be double wrapped. That drives me a little bit bonkers. Just because like I get, I get all ready to do the videos and then I find that it's double wrapped. So we'll go through the guidebook later. But I did have my trusty... This is handy, so let me just carefully cut the second one. I've had to use like my teeth before. Yeah, I think that's good. Do 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 do. <laughs> okay. Okay. So and then we have the backs. Not gonna lie, not my favorite backs in the world. Um, compared to the front work, which I've seen quite a few of the cards, it feels a little washed out. Look, look how brilliant that looks and sharp. And um, if it's non-reversible, which is fine, like you can't reverse it. I don't read reversals, especially not with Oracle decks. But with this, but this woman's artwork, with um, Melanie's artwork, I can't imagine there wasn't a plethora of designs. This just feels a little lazy. Uh, not gonna lie. Uh, I don't think US Game Systems really cares <laughs> what I think. It's not gilded. It is a standard tarot size. Now, I am not gonna try to pronounce some of these names because I'm gonna get them completely wrong, but I'm not a massive fan of the back. It's a bit ugly, to be honest. Like, if you were going to do flowers, why not do like a... F anyway. Anyway, that's just my... That's probably going to be the only thing I don't like about the deck. Let's have a look. So, She Who battle Battles. Justice Fierce Commitment. Abalonica. I'm going to say that's how you say that one. Took me a couple of tries. That shoulder piece is so cool Eternia she who becomes metamorphosis transcend and journey I like that the borders it doesn't go to the edges on the sides that the borders have these beautiful little details in it there's enough keywords I'm not a massive fan of keywords on my decks but Oracle decks, I find it a lot more stomachable. Tarot decks, I can't. <laughs> Tarot decks, I've had to rehome a bunch of them, even if I love the artwork. Amelia, uh, Amelia, Curiosity, Destiny, and Search, She Who Questions. The artwork is so, so pretty. Oh, she's fierce. Has she got bees in her hair? Oh, God, yes. Living for that. You can probably hear my dog in the background, Thor. <laughs> she who resists, fearless, justified, resistant. And it's the Adusa. Uh, no. 
Aduaz. Yeah, like I said, I'm gonna butcher these. I don't mean to. Elias, she's so cool. It's very Bowie-esque, but also like a um, Harlequin. She who grants wishes, wish, desires, hope. I have a feeling that this is a um, a body of artwork that was turned into an Oracle deck. Not mad at it. I just there is a definite different feel. Blanche. <laughs> It reminds me of the Golden Girls. She who brings light. That hair piece is everything. Light, serenity, and beacon. Blue. She who loved once. Fragile, secret love, rejection. Rise, she who surprises, surprise, discovery, revelation. I don't know if Bryze is meant to be her her uh, name, but I like to think that that B is silent <laughs> in, in my world. Carly, she who frees. Oh, I like how it's like a a, a um, synonym, or not a synonym. Is that a synonym? Yeah, a like word for Carly, Carly Ma. Liberation, unrestrained, and freedom. I like her a lot. I've heard, that is really rad. She's beautiful. Colette, she who nurtures, empathy, gentleness, insight. Concia, she who whispers, secrets, confessions, confidant. All of these like beautiful headpieces and flowers in the hair, I'm living for it. Desiree, she who yearns, yearn, longing, pine for. She who longs for the moon, hey? And the night. Eclat, she who regrets, oof. Powerful, battle, victory, bitterness. Very much that like, what is, what are you going to Sacrifice, you know, in that moment. Elixir. She who forgives. Remorse, guilt, forgiveness. I do like that there is both the shadow and light um, keywords on here, like a lot, because it gives you both sides that without it being all light on one side and then having to go find it. Anid. She who doubts, fear, weariness, trust. So that's really cool. And the artwork is really quite splendiferous. Stefania, she who surrenders, chain, bondage, release. She who just got a Dear John letter and is like, why did I give that man my heart? He a scumbag. We all know that one. Oh, jeez, Manise. Arwen, what are you doing to me, woman? Uh, Etrinti, oh, who knows, that's how she's saying it to me. I love the bird. Um, she who enfolds, swath, embrace, self-care. She who swaddles the soul. Oh, hello. Oh, I want to see that up close. Damn. The seven of hearts and the death. So that's like the choice of death. Uh, Futura. She who divines, future choice judgment. She's like everything. Oh my gosh, even the little like key... And she's got a die, and then, oh, that's so cute. Geneva, she who radiates, knowing ambition, confidence. These are all very beautiful, whoops, women. Again, these bats, and they're killing me. Hannah, she who listens, understanding, witness, compassion. And I don't care that there is, there is all just, these are all just beautiful pieces of artwork and they're all beautiful women. I'm cool with that. Iris, she who changes. Oh, I live. Transformation, change, enchantment. I love the armband. I love the circlet. I love the smoky eye. I love the hair. That would probably be my matrix look. Um, Isra, she who dreams, escape dreams and fantasy. Jenna, she who calms, oh my god, Jenna is everything. 
that our stillness, purity and quiet, it reminds me kind of of that she's a shapeshifter. She's got that peacock, those white peacock feathers. And like she's coming up from the still lake there. Jocelyn, she who persists, perspective defiant, persistent. Really gorgeous. Kamala, she who emerges, enlightenment, mindfulness, and rise up. Very lady of the lake. Oh, hello, sunshine. Makita, she who sees, observe, perceive, scrutinize. I love this. I want to make this for Halloween next year. A big headpiece like that. Very, I guess, very The Lion King. That reminds me of the stage production, which made me cry. Uh, Manara, she who waits, patient waiting determination. Manatili, she who remains. Yes, Ice Queen, powerful devotion, true worth. I am the Ice Queen of Queens. Maputla, 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 she who guides, new path guide renewal. Very Yule esque, isn't it? That one with the holly, the mistletoe kind of. Is that holly or mistletoe? It feels very Yule esque, this one. Laura, she who hesitates, ponder, delay, confidence. <clears throat> Another one that I really like here. Nemesis, she who avenges, she, which is plotting her revenge. Revenge, outcome, justice. And what cards do we have? Let's see if I can see. No, I don't know. But I do like that there are tarot cards there. And she's got a spell book out. And she's like, bitch, I will not, I will not take your shit no more. It's like, even that candle is a bit foreboding, right? That girl is poison. <laughs> and the mask down there. Oh, I love that. That's great. Orchid, she who thrives, flourish, prosper, blossom. Pearl, she who rises up. <laughs> How's your head, Pearl? <laughs> Anyone who watches Drag Race will get that. Empower, unlip, unlip, uh, uplift, elevate. Perpetua, she who aches, sadness, solitude, silent, withdrawal. Damn, son. Yeah, that looks a bit achy. That looks like it'd be freezing freaking cold. Primavera, she who begins, launch, actualize potential. Also, she who is delicious on pasta. <laughs> I'm not the only one who thought that. <laughs> I can't be the only one who thought that, but really beautiful. Like I said, the artwork is just stunning. Renee, she who hopes. Oh, it's like Tatiana, the frog, the princess and the frog. Oh, I love that. Tiana, sorry. Hope, love, relationships. You gotta kiss a few frogs. Actually, frogs would be better than some of the things that I've had to experience. <laughs> Regina, she who instigates. Oh, leadership, provo provocation, and power, provocation. That's so cool. She's fierce. I like her a lot. Oh, Savage, like almost savage. She who is wild, untamed, wild, mysterious. Very Oracle of Delphi vibes, that one. Shailia, she who creates creativity, originality, and spontaneity. She's got on her shoulder a little lizard. I have a lizard on my shoulder. Taraz, she who is present, now awareness acceptance, and she is the cover art for the box. Oh, hello. Valencia, damn, she who stands. It was resolute, implacable, determined. I love that. Come through, Viking queen. Valaris, oh, she's stunning too. Dare, do, reach, she who flies. I love how intense the eyes are in this. 
And then Yelena, She Who Knows, Wisdom, Clarity and Resolution. And finally, Zenith, She Who Prepares, Formulate, Strategize, Devise. Wow. Very fantasy, very um, extravagant, very beautiful, very fantasy world. It kind of reminds me a little bit of the labyrinth, like a dreamy um, Stevie Nicks, Fleetwood Mac, 80s, like, you know, 90s. I love it. Um, very, very pretty. Let's go through the guidebook now. So this is written by Arwen Lynch Poe. Okay. Thank yous, introduction, featuring magnificent female warriors and women of great compassion and wisdom, 44 heroines. I really like that. You could even do such a beautiful amount of, I know one of Arwen's um, Specialities is story work and fiction work and spell work through that, so I really enjoy that. So we go straight into the meanings of the cards. And then we have the meaning and some questions for journaling or contemplation. What else we've we got in here? Okay. And then the card spreads. Exploring self spread. The messenger spread, and then card spread notes, and then about the artist and about the author. So cute. Let's draw a card and see what information we get because it's part of this crazy little thing I do in my unboxings. Really shuffles beautifully, but I really like. Um, US Game Systems cardstock. I think they do a really good job with that. Come on. They just they shuffle so well. <laughs> it looks like shuffling them is quite the treat. Okay. Isra. She Who Dreams, Escape Dreams and Fantasies. Now this is in alphabetical order, making it very, very easy. As long as you know your alphabet. <laughs> uh, she Who Dreams, She Rests Upon a Rock. So talking a little bit about the artwork. The message brought by Isra is to honor your dreams. They allow you a sanctuary where you can occasionally disappear and give your doubts and worries a much needed break. Oh my stars. I had a dream last night about being in a relationship with a very spunky person and it, they were very attractive and it was very vivid and I remember like all this like uh, oc pre premonition within the dream. It was really strange. Like I could see premonition of what was going to happen inside the dream. It was very cool. Um, and then the questions, what is my craziest dream? How can I make time to indulge in these dreams? And when do I need to utilize this mental escape technique the most? I've talked about this before, um, especially in the coven, the group that I run, um, and also with people. It's like I have this, I've been training myself through many, many years uh, to do a very, um, to do like being able to get out of my body and take away from the physical discomfort in the moment or being impatient in the moment, which has really helped when I've done things like my sweat lodge experiences, when I've had a lot of flying and I've had to like layways or being very impatient. It's like disconnecting from the trigger or disconnecting from the fact that it's like I have to give up the control. It's been very, very um, like getting out of the pain or like giving birth and, and breathing through that and knowing how to like channel the pain energy. So yeah, I've, I, um, yeah, that's some interesting thoughts on that. So uh, for myself, <laughs> I don't know about anybody else, but you can get the Elki Oracle or She Who Oracle anywhere that you buy books like Amazon or Book Depository in your bookshops and usgamesystems.com. Thank you so very much for watching and I will see you all next time.